Good morning, folks. Welcome back to streams. Uh, yesterday, I took yesterday off because the week before was stressful. But yesterday, until like around 6, 7 p.m., my internet was out, so I just kind of had to exist at home. <laughs> so hopefully I can make make up for it with some streams today. I, was, I didn't plan on streaming yesterday, but I wanted to at least, like, you know, watch some while I was doing other stuff, maybe. Wow! Good morning, Neki. Hope you are well this morning, my friend. Just in time. We're getting ready to start with Wario Land. Um, before we begin, though, I'm still fundraising for the LGBTQ Freedom Fund. They pay a bill to secure the... Uh, words to secure the safety and liberty of individuals in jail and immigration detention i've got i've got a donate command exclamation point donate i've got a donation button below the stream my chatbot shares the donation command every 30 minutes and there's a qr code on the screen when the stream's up that will take you to the donation i don't get anything back from it personally it's just it's just an easy way for me to support uh, a good cause any support's greatly appreciated even if you don't donate but good morning, Nikki. How was how was your week? The last time I streamed was Wednesday, so there's that's enough time for week to. Good morning, my friend. Good morning. Hope you are doing well. I've got just in time, just in time. Got some. My coffee's still hot. <laughs> we got we got a freaking. You saw that what you saw what we cut last night. I I almost died that last kill <laughs> because my dumbass forgot potions because I always forget potions, but <laughs> it was a good time. Uh let me unpause the game here. Uh oh. <clears throat> Now is weekend. Very true, my friend. Ooh, sleepy cat. It's great. Yeah, like you know, like a five, like basically five KCs. All right, Ram races. That's nuts. Like, there's no reason we should be that lucky. <laughs> but hey, we take those. <laughs> yeah, I like that emote, Neki. Let me see. Let me get a closer look at it. Hype sleep. Yes, I like that. Um, I think we're gonna do some uh, nightmare on uh, Sunday. Maybe some raids or something too, but. For now, I'm playing this fucking game. It's, there goes Captain Sarah with the, with her slash our treasure. <laughs> Back out of that level. Mmm. Hell yeah. Okay, we already saw that. Alright, I pressed B and it, it like cancelled out of the starting the level, which is weird. Yeah, I gotta get into some nightmare zone myself whenever I get the chance, cause yeah, my my melees are still a little low for stuff like uh theater of blood. <laughs> He's a fisher of men. Is that Jesus Christ? 
Oh, I, I see your, your stinky little fucking fishing lure. No, I, I feel ya. Like, all this, like, last, like, month and some change, we've been getting prepped for the go live at the hospital and, like, no, no, no desire whatsoever to commit to something like, like, you know, raids or anything like that. I just couldn't do it to myself. I was struggling. Oh, I need an enemy for that. Whoops. <laughs> I was just, like, clobbering everything because it's just very cathartic to just smash through everything in this game. Just... smash and destroy everything. It's really fun. We went to a different, um, we went from a different uh, EMR to a different one completely. Like, we changed from one to the other. And, um, yeah, I, I guess you could say core software. And it, it, it was and still continues to be a fucking disaster. some such shit just doesn't want to work how it's supposed to for some reason. A lot of weird bugs in the system, just, ugh. Ooh, more coins. Uh... Yeah, lots of, uh, mental suffering. In part because they're like, oh, y'all don't need to know anything about this. You know, how to actually like, operate the new uh, EMR, and it's like, okay, cool. And then people are calling, uh, how do I do this? It's like, uh, <laughs> uh, I don't know. Somebody should have told me too. Good amount of coins at stage. Let's see, what number are you? Um, it's probably three. The giant spear man. Oh, fuck. Alright, get me right in the booty hole. Oh, uh, that sounds like a procedural issue and not a technical issue. I'll reach out to your manager. Oh, God. Yeah, it's just like. There's like so many things where it's like, uh, they're like, the people that handle like all the stuff, back end stuff are like, oh, it's definitely hardware, but we've, the hardware was literally worked the entire time. And it's like, um, no, it's not. And we have to fucking pull teeth to get anyone to believe us about anything for some reason. I don't know why. It's, it's, been, it's been very frustrating. Mm, 
sneaky shit. Oh. Shit. <laughs> oh. You yet live. Yes. Okay. I'm pretty sure this is probably just like the treasure of this level, but... Let's pulverize this little bitch. No, no, just, just extra money. There's one thing I like, it's money! Let's toss this little fucker up there. I need your money. <laughs> just... Technical janitors of. Yeah! Yeah! L literal. You are absolutely fucking correct. It's. It's pretty awful. Give me all the monies! No! Okay, it's probably not worth it to get those monies. I do it anyway. No. Oh. The time, the time to resource ratio for these coins is very poor, but you know what? It's fun. But when Gladys loses her vacation calendar, they never right, right. It's like, mm, I see where your priorities lie, and it's not with treating us like human beings for fixing your fucking shit. Oh, this turtle's farting. Look at him go. He's just like, oh, I got so much ass gas. <laughs> this is probably the treasure. No, I'm wrong again. I haven't played this game in a million years, so don't remember where all the exits go. Ooh, more Morio money, or I guess it's technically not even his money. He just stole it, and now he's trying to steal it back. <laughs> Shit, I missed him. Well, guess we get to go all the way back. Whee! Well, at least most of the garbage is out of the way now, so we can just kind of focus on the, the actual jumping. Awful eyes will fire. Oh, that's why. <clears throat> that's that. It's, it's probably a joke I told the last time I streamed this, but yeah, that's like Taco Bell. <laughs> Eat Taco Bell, and that's how you're feeling a little bit later. <laughs> Oh, here's the boss. Well, we can come back to this. I'm gonna get. I want to get more money. Is there anything else over here? No, nope. doesn't really look like it.
see if we can get through this. We're gonna have to like do some pretty sick jumps. Nice, okay. I was thinking that's how you, that's that's almost certainly the uh, treasure room that we're not really going for. And yeah, I'm not really going for these because I'm bad at matching. Granted, on easy, it's well very easy, but yeah, I'm not really that worried about it. Ow. There we go. <laughs> Taco Bell's more for rental. <laughs> yeah, it it it, 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 it it returned. It's like it's like Star Wars: Return of the Jedi. It it, it comes back with a vengeance. Okay, so that's immediately like it's either one or seven. It is one. <laughs> All right. Next level. Through the thorny maze. Oh, I think I remember this one. Maybe not specifically specifically this part of this one, but hmm. little creature. Bastard's got a much shorter window than I was expecting, so we'll go under this way. Hmm, I don't think I can fit up there. Not quite. That's fine. I'll have to go all the way around. the expression of these seagulls are just like, oh shit! <laughs> So I gotta do a jump or two. Hmm, I 
got a feeling that's probably not the intended way of getting it over there. <laughs> oh, sneaky secrets! Didn't even mean to do that, but that's cool. So one thing is I love about this game is there's just like lots of little just secrets everywhere. That's a pretty tight uh, gap to jump. Alright. There we go. What we got in here? Oh, this. Don't care. <laughs> Alright, so this area can be ignored. This is the part of the level that I remember. Probably, probably guess why. This is just a little, just a little tedious. I mean, it could be worse. At least this level's interesting, but. I picked the absolute worst one to drop down. <laughs> the one with no money. Well, I took a bit of a hit. That's okay. What? I guess we have to go this way. R riveting real time. Well, if that's that way. What's over here? Just more money? I mean, I could be convinced. It's like kind of the whole point of the game is money. There was some spot, but I just didn't really, uh... It's like an alternate path, but basically it's the same place, seems like. Just a slightly different path. Alright, cool. Coffee! It's probably uh, four. Yeah, it's four. Oh, we just got here, Wario. Why do you want to escape from Maze Woods? Oh. Well, I guess you get to see this now. I'm gonna get you, little bitch. I'm gonna get you. That's 
It's gotta be like my favorite part about this game is like all this like the goofy ass transformations Wario does because he gets like stung or something by stuff. And then using those to like go to different parts of the level to get like more treasure or whatever. Oh, damn it! Wakey old man. Allergic to fucking bees. <laughs> hmm. Let's see what's up here, because it feels like there's stuff up here. Ah. Uh, not really. Hello Cloudy, good morning! We are playing more Wario Land and I'm getting an allergic reaction to bees! <laughs> Fucking love this game. It's so silly. Okay, we need the enemy for that. I mean, this B is not gonna count for that because if I step on it, it'll just like die. Sting me, B. Hmm. Ain't that a mood? <laughs> Ah, <laughs> uh, it's just this crap that I don't care to do. And normally I'd be all about that, but I just... Okay, where's the fucking bee? Hmm. 
bastard. Brouch. I hope your morning is going well today, though. Powish. Okay, yeah, that door is a little treasure game, which I don't care about. Is there like a hill somewhere I can jump off of? Ah, oh, there is. Okay, that explains what I gotta do. I gotta like, I gotta thread the needle and do some jumps. Wee wee up. Uh, perhaps I should start from the top. There we go. Well, I wonder which one it is. <laughs> I couldn't tell if it was gonna be a six or eight, so I, I didn't want to risk it. So I just let it flip all of them over. It's like 450 coins, which you can do that. You can just let it flip all of them over for you. Just gotta get have enough coins to pay the piper. Defeat the giant bee. Yeah, it, I think it was it did end up being eight. But it, six also shares very similar uh, thingies to that, so I wanted to make sure. Cause, Cause I quite enjoy this game, but I don't want to like play too many levels over again just because I messed up. It doesn't sound like super fun. He's like, I'm gonna fucking kill you. Uh, I should probably get stung. Just, ju just implant head firmly into Stinger. Come on, thank you. Here's the boss arena. Let's try to get a little up. Oh, bastard. Let's try to get some some money. And if we do this, just throw them mostly straight through. Not forever, but for long enough to get most of these cleared. And these boss stages tend to be a little light on treasure. Or at least they can be. I think they, I mean, this one probably has more coins in it. Like, probably up this direction. Like, in the, like through this door, there might be more money. S sequestered away. Oh yeah, looks like there should be. What do we have in here? Ah. This is where you get spit out if you fail the boss fight. That's how this game handles, um, failure. Is it usually just kind of slightly inconveniences you, which is 
A lot better than it can be said about a lot of other games from this era where like if you like die you get like sent all the way fucking back to a checkpoint that might not even exist so it's like this game is very uh, lenient. Oh, oh sneaky fucking sneaky huh. I was like, wait, why is that guy just standing there, of all pl of all and only there? Oh, it's just this. That is sneaky as fuck, though, because you wouldn't have found this if I hadn't seen this little guy was just pacing back and forth, like, right here. And only right here. Where where'd he go? But he just got fucking despawned. <laughs> Ripperoo. Let's go through this again to respawn the enemies. I think there might be a little bit more treasure up here. I can't see. Ah, yep, there was just a little bit more. Hey, that counts. Okay, yeah, this, this level is pretty treasure light. Man, of course, you can just kill enemies as long as you want to get money, but. Mm. I'd rather just fight the boss and go to somewhere else. It's gonna be a big bee! Looks like a bird. I probably have to smash in his little stinky fucking bald ass head. Yep, that's it. Bald ass head. Oh. So we got a dodge or otherwise dispense with the little babies. And then Big B is gonna probably like one more hit. And there's gonna be like Oh, you you're not even done yet. You're gonna just come on out. Okay, yep. Okay, that wasn't so bad. It's not exactly anything groundbreakingly difficult, but it's interesting at least. Alright. Okay, that could be like several numbers. Okay, that's it's almost certainly eight. Continue down this way because this leads to the next, like, the branching paths that uh, combine. But there's this spot that we have to go get a, um. Like, this is the first, this is the boss level of the first, like, uh, stage area. It's, like, inside Wario's Castle, but there's a hidden e exit. So let's find that. Hmm. Hmm. <clears throat> I got a feeling I, I'm supposed to like, maybe fail the boss, and then I can find the secret exit that way. Oh no, I just had to have get I just had to get good. Get all this money. Holy shit. <clears throat> that or I had to notice that there's like I have a feeling they didn't expect me to actually make this ju that jump, but Yeah, they didn't expect me to make that jump. Well, well jokes on them. Apparently I just hit just the right angle to make that jump. <laughs> Yes. <clears throat> All right, so we're gonna we're gonna get we're gonna get vored by the snake. Oh, 
That's also the Taco Bell experience. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Alright, we got- oops. <laughs> you just hear like, mmm, that was good, and then you're like, oh fuck, alright. Time to go. <laughs> this game is fun. I like this game. Okay, this is like the top part of the- Oh great, now we're Zombie Wario. You don't normally see this till much later in the game, when it, you actually have to use it to like pass through platforms and stuff. But it's kind of in like the off. <laughs> Brains. <laughs> what that means though is we gotta lose the fight again to get back up there. Thankfully, you don't really lose anything other than getting put somewhere else in the level. So, you don't like lose, you don't even lose coins, you just kinda get embarrassed by a snake. Man, I don't wanna think of how many s of those snakes are in the Wario's world, cause, I mean, you saw how quickly it made an egg? That's kind of grimly impressive how fast it made an egg, you know? Uh, I think the only thing this way anyway is like the little uh, treasure for the uh... Oh god damn it, you know what time it is. Yeah, we're, I'm not gonna even bother about going that way. I think the only th the thing that's that way is the like the treasure item that I'm not like getting in these stages anyway. Oh, I didn't mean to hit you snake, sorry. I'll, I'll properly present my butt like I'm supposed to. <laughs> Alright, so I think we go this way. That's where the secret exit is. Yep, this is very familiar. Yep. Hidden exit! <clears throat> In Wario's basement, he just has like a hidden exit. And we already got the one for this level, so we just get the pocket coins. Fine by me. Now we got this. He's like, my stolen loot! Where is it? Ah! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Down he goes! Into the pit you go! Oh, I don't know if I like this, it's just like... Invisible platforms. that turns lights on. Come here, you little bastard crunch. I'm trying to think of, why, of some reason for that little guy to be there. Probably just to be in the way. Now that I'm thinking about it. That's what it seems like. They're just kind of in the way. That's okay. see in there so let's see if we can find uh... 
Their expression is apt because they know exactly what's about to happen to them. <laughs> Just pulverized and turned into coins. They're like, oh god! Hmm. You, you, surely you're in here, here for a reason. To make this fucking nightmare fuel ass transformation of Spring Wario. Ah, I knew there was a fucking door over here. Little bastards, there's one over there too. Okay. What's in here? M more darkness. I just kind of randomly hopping. I don't even know. Wasn't sure if I was supposed to like fall or something in this room or like. Oh, there's probably a hole. I mean, I mean, he stopped. Oh, yep. There, I, I was like, I knew there's got, there's got to be like a, a gap in the platform somewhere. Just freaking like nothing personnel kit. Oh, there is a door. Ah, oh, well, it's just this. I was like, there's there's almost certainly a door down here somewhere. Kind of like blindly press the up <laughs> the up key to find the door. All right, well we don't have to come back in here because that's just the uh, the treasure room thingy. Perish. I'm not a fan of how dark it is. There's probably a little switch somewhere. Oh, there's ghosts! Woo! I think those also turn into a zombie, uh, zombie Wario. Like, we'll just. Yep, they do. I thought they did! Yeah, this is this is considered a uh, one of the bonus missions, so it's like they've got like stuff from throughout the game just all in here in these, which is interesting that you can kind of encounter this stuff much earlier than you otherwise would. Not that it's really consequential, because it's not like any of these stuff makes it harder to like do anything. It's just different uh, gameplay elements they didn't don't introduce till later in the game intentionally. where the giant spearman is. Yep, there they are. Alright, cool. I hope this is as entertaining as I'm having as much I hope this is entertaining in the slightest because I'm having a great time just playing this game again. <laughs> it's been years. Man, I guess that's not even the point of my channel is to have other people enjoy it for so much as like I am if I'm not having a good time, yeah, like right, that's probably that's almost certainly six. Like 
I would love it if people enjoyed things I do, but I'm partially streaming for me, you know, <laughs> so that I have a good time. Because if I'm not having a good time, I'm not streaming it. Let's be, let's be real. Avoid the rocks. Okay, I don't see any rocks. I killed the enemies so that I can kind of climb around and grab all the monies. That being said, once I finish Warrior Land 2, which will probably end up being like maybe next week, because I mean, this game's got more to it than what I'm doing but I'm not gonna go back and get all the treasure that that take way that take more just more time I don't really feel like dealing with up oh, there's a rock oh I, I was I had a feeling that's what was gonna happen if I got hit by a rock <laughs> I fucking love this goofy ass shit some water. Don't know how re-moisturizing Wario makes him not flat anymore, but you know. count as enemies, which is nice. Ooh, we can just crunch through, get some more. Break on through to the other side. I'm sure that's like a song. Sounds like it. I think it is. It's like some sort of like prog rock bullshit. He's a sponge! Oh, that, that, you know what? That would explain a lot. I mean, he's like, he's, he is like a treasure sponge. He's like, I'm gonna take all this treasure. Oh yeah, we need a, uh, little rock. Oh, what's there, anything over here? Oh, no! No! Okay, I wasn't expecting to actually be able to make it through there like that, but we did. Just... Wario's pure desire for treasure. Well, I don't really say pure, but his desire for treasure. Considering all the treasure I was stealing back in this game, he originally stole from the person that stole it back. So he's stealing back his stolen treasure. <laughs> I, I actually looked into that. <laughs> um, before stream, I was like, well, firstly, I was looking up. I could. I thought I remembered who the, ca the the captain lady's name is, but I couldn't fully remember. So I, I looked that up, and then I was like, wait, where did the treasure originally come from? And turns out it was her treasure to begin with that she stole from somewhere else, and now we Wario stole it, and then she stole it back, and now we're stealing it back again. <laughs> we're stealing it back back, I guess. I don't know. Fucking ducks. Pirate duck ass. It's 
not a very well hidden uh, treasure room. to be like the perfect configuration of uh thingies. Yeah we need Damn it, you little bastard. Oh that works. Oh well that's the exit. We're not really interested in that quite yet. Let's let's roll. Wario tuck and roll. Uh, you gotta be flat to get through here. <clears throat> Only the flat go here. <laughs> Sounds like some Lord of the Rings bullshit. Only the flat man will take me down! Here comes the flat man! With his wiggly ass eyeballs. <laughs> I guess the third Wario Land is kind of like a Metroidvania, which is funny because it's like from like the year like 2000. It's like ancient. And there's oh, well, shit. <laughs> Grab me. Like it's an it's an Metroidvania in the case where like its levels are like Metroidvania like kind of stages. Watching old games feels comfy. Well, I'm glad playing old games is comfy because this is a game I still have for my Game Boy Color that I played on like car rides and you know that kind of stuff. And I I I adored the shit out of. I probably beat it like a few times, honestly. Because it's just, just fun. It's just a fun game. Okay. Zero. At some point, I probably at some point I I, I have discussed this with um, Cloudy, but I might embarrass myself on stream and try playing the first Castlevania. I'm n I've I've never played much of it, and I'm probably not very good at it, and it's it's gonna be pain. But you know, stop that train! Oh, guess Wario has a train in his fucking cellar. And there's a train. There's a there's a train like la la level later in the in the city kind of like zone. But yeah, I guess Wario just has his own fucking. I mean, it makes sense. He he kind of goes all out in everything he does. So having a train is not shouldn't really that be that much of a surprise, I guess. Because I think this is all in his cellar. Oh, almost got my my coins cut out of me. <sighs> 
They, they have like a physics thing for this part, this, this part of the level. That's awesome, actually. That's like... Ah! <laughs> okay, that was, that felt good. It feels really, really cathartic to just like dash tackle at shit and just destroy it. Like make these like sick ass jumps. Oh. oh, I woke up the I woke up those fuckers. There's a woman in my video game. That's what those things remind me of. <laughs> Not women in video games, but like the people that complain about women in video games. I want to murder this little critter, but like getting back up here is proving to be a, tr a task. I oh, got him. How dare you, how dare you put black people in Final Fantasy? This is Europe, don't you know? Right. Uh, this is where we came from? No, nope, this is a different little train, track, uh, car. I have a feeling we're not able to get up. No, we're not gonna. We'll have to, we'll have to come back from the different. Oh! <laughs> I, was in, I was in danger. My brain's like, danger time, go! I like trains. Oh, train! I I I was one. Of, I was a train. I was a train autistic kid myself. Just really like trains. Can't ex can not explain why. Just really like trains. Trains are good. Oh, I needed the little little spear man. Fuck. <laughs> I've actually ridden on, I've actually r ridden, rode on an Amtrak in my adult life, so that was, that was pretty pleasant. Alright, well here's how we uh, stop the train. Okay, it's, train stopped. <laughs> Okay, that's not, it's nine. Actually, I think there's a chance it could still been five, so I, I think that was a bit of a gamble on my, my end there. Not that that's, the level's really that long anyway, but, you know. Find the exit. Oh, all right. It, it seems to be a thing because I'm almost certainly autistic and I was a mad... Anyway, anyway, I'm autistic and I like trains. Yeah, like, I, it's... Unfortunately, seems to be a very um, common thing. Can't explain why. I never would be able to explain why to you. It, it's like that, but... It's... Um, but anyway, I'm, a, I'm an autistic and I like trains. <laughs> Ah, I see. That sneaky bastard's like, oh, the exit's right there. Just find it, Lolameo. And it's like. It's like, yeah, sure, I'll just find that exit. Be right back. Don't, th don't throw a delicious cake at me. Whatever will I do? <clears throat> I 
We don't need eyes where we're going. Which is apparently this, uh... Apparently this room, but there's probably like a light switch in here somewhere. Uh, yep, yeah, we gotta get... We got... Babe, it's time for your uh, 9 a.m. dick flying appointment. <laughs> Oh, fucking hell. Alright, now I gotta... Alright, 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 alright. Yeah, I basically found most of these little spots. Uh... I love the bonk noise of when you bonk two enemies together in this game. It's, it's, those bats are up to no good. Hmm. Surely they don't like have some like treasure hidden somewhere. With the, oh they, oh they do. Sneaky fucks. Just gonna hide coins from me like that. If they got one there, it means, hmm. I wonder if I wonder if I can still if I somehow make a jump. Hmm. Hmm. I wonder if it, so. You can make a jump there. I wonder if there's something up there. Oh, there is! Oh, that's so satisfying. It's like, not really even a puzzle, but it's just really satisfying. And I, if, I don't know if I would have been able to shoulder tackle that, but it felt really good doing that with the roll. <laughs> I, I love that about this. There's so many just like little crunchy walls. <clears throat> oh, I gotta get fat. Err. Little bastards in the way. Alright, little cake man. What do we have here? Is this a little... Well, I'll have just extra treasure laying around over here. Let's murder this duck. Ah, there's a light switch, okay. Let's 
see what we got. Oh, that's mean. Yeah, I never would have. I would. I never would have figured that out. <laughs> I was like, or this. I am. I'm scared of that game. That game is fucking hard. But maybe at some point I should. I mean, look at me. <laughs> I am a mean bean. I don't think I'm that mean, but sometimes I need to be mean because I think sometimes I'm probably a little too nice to certain people, I guess, or certain situations. So I gotta be a little. I got. I gotta get mean. Feed me. Feed me. Oh no 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 no. Oh god damn it, I'm too big! I'm too powerful! Oh, hello, bu by the way, Bunny. Me and my big ass can't fit through. <laughs> there we go. Out of the way, mortal. Me and my thick ass are, go are getting treasure. <laughs> um, I can see what's in this door. It's probably the treasure for this. Nope, it's not. It's like spinning star things, though. Good for them. There's that, although it's already lit up, so I don't know if I need to do that. Uh, what's in here? Oh, it's for this room. I think I see how they did this level. They have like something that like alternates the 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 palettes or whatever. Oh, well, I guess there's the exit. Absolutely, dude. Dude's got a fucking dumpy the size of Texas. You gotta respect it. And he uses his well. I wouldn't say for good, cause I mean, he is stealing treasure. But you know what? It's fine. He uses his dumpy for productive things. It's a, something we could all learn to learn to live by. He's, <laughs> Uh, is this the treasure room? No, this is just more... Wait a second, did I just... I think I opened a... Yeah, okay, this is an... this was an earlier part of the level. I was like, wait, I've been here before. Okay, that, that little thing I did just opened a uh, shortcut through the rest of... Damn, I just got cake sniped. Dude's like, mm, you're gonna love this shit. I'm like, yeah, totally. Well, I don't know if there's much else in this level, so I'm just gonna pulverize this last cake dude against the wall. <laughs> and here's the exit. I'm trying to get- I'm trying to beat all the levels and get all these little panels in this playthrough. Okay, that is almost certainly a zero. Cause you get to make like a little a little painting, it's cool. Defeat the cave master. That's what your mom calls me. Nobody calls me. Oh. Ooh, spooky vampire. Must just need this fucker out of the way. Actually, morph me. It's, it's zombie time. I 
don't think those guys respawn. Well, maybe if I leave the room and come back, they will, but yeah. Now that we are... We got Zambified. Oh, these ones are pissed off too. Yeah, later on in the game, those, uh, those, like, zombie kind of, that kind of zombie status is used to, uh, make it to where you fall through platforms and it's, it can be a little annoying. I don't know how I did that, but... Money! I don't see you, zombie man. Oh. I love just smashing the walls. It's very fun. Just... There's an area down there, and it makes me wonder if I can get there from... Oh! get up there. I don't know if I can jump that high. Can I break this? No. Hmm. So it's almost certainly related to, um, that. I'm feeling I probably needed to, like, not break something particularly at a certain time or something. I'm sure I'm saying some words that make sense, but yeah, like I'm just, I don't think I can get over there right now. Or maybe I messed up or something. I don't think there was an enemy in here I could bounce off of, but I mean, I can reset things to double check. No, not quite. Okay. I think I'm just gonna leave it alone. It's just like, you'll never get this. You'll never get this. Damn it. Didn't mean to do that, but it's kind of like the most inconvenient place to place these little blocks like this. There's the boss of the level. Let's see if we can scrounge up some more, uh, some more money. Damn it! No! <laughs> I was gonna bounce off him, but then the power of cake just uh, provided me with um, 
This, the, the instant cake change. Ah, I see what they want you to do. Okay. Let's uh, go through the cake obstacle course. Let's take this little bastard with me if I can. Oh shit. Oh, they despawn. Yeah, they despawn like on a fucking whim. Oh, shit. I don't know how I managed to do that. I was trying to jump and throw him, but then, like, you just kind of, like, dropped him. Play games. Luckily, it's a wiki. Yay, games! Good. Playing games brings me joy, so I'm glad to at least help in some way with that. You know, words. All right, I got all the coins there. Yeah, I was really hoping I was able to get that uh, the little black spinning coins. Those are rare drop coins. I think they have a hundred a piece. So yeah, it's always. It's always worth it to like kill enemies that are in your way and break those blocks because sometimes they can drop blows. This is probably just the treasure of the, the level, but it's fine. Murdered. I murdered him with my fat. <laughs> yep, thought so. I don't really want to deal with these. I'm not good at matching, and putting on the easy setting is feels fucking demeaning as shit because it's like really sl It's very well easy. It's exactly what you expect it to be. But it's just, I don't really get much satisfaction out of those, so we're just not doing them. Alright, let's see what the this boss is. Oh, I remember this. I don't remember exactly how we fight it, but I remember this. It's a piggy! I think he shoulder tackles as well. <laughs> you just knock him off the side. Oh! Oh, sneaky. And then, yep, if you fail the boss, you uh, just kind of get sent down. Oh, I, I saw this. The fuck is what happened to this boss? What happened to the room? The camera got all weird. Okay, so we're gonna fail it again and then we'll see if we can get the first part. It looked like there was some treasure hidden by a, a rolly thing. Let's try it. We'll try a, a roll jump. Or maybe they're just teasing me. Okay, they're just teasing me. That's fine. But yeah, that's one of my favorite de design things about the boss. About this game is the bosses. Like, if you fail them, you almost never lose coins, and you just gotta kind of get sent back to like a, a slightly earlier part of the level. It takes like maybe 20 seconds at tops to like. Ha <laughs> ha 
<laughs> Bonk. Oh, oh god, his palate's fucked up. It means he's hard now. It's probably gonna do another jump. Nope. The walk of shame. Thankfully, it's not much of a walk in this game. Okay, that was a very easy boss. <laughs> it's usually a very short walk in this game. Which is nice. They could have made it a lot worse. I, th I have a feeling that's four. Nice. I like when I get good hints like that so I can just like, you know, do the thing. Alright. So all those le all the all the all the pre these previous levels have their little panels done. And I inadvertently got this level's treasure because I don't know. It was kind of an annoying spot and I just felt like getting it. Alright, so now we can go to this level. Oh, this is the start of the city! There's Captain Syrup. She's like, Come on, motherfuckers, hurry up! You! Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Eleven. <laughs> oh, is, is this the train level? It is the train. This is the actual train level. Like, Wario has his own train. Like, it's, it's like his own little subway place in his cellar, it seems like. But this is the train in the city. This is public transportation, not Wario transportation. <laughs> Kill this duck. Got him. Okay. Mostly because they're kind of a pain in the ass. I saw some way to get up off the, out of the train I kept here, so it's... Oh, shit, well... Oh, I gotta do this thing again. We do, we need another Wario game like, kinda like these. Again. Like, not just little fucking mini-games, I've never really liked the micro-games stuff that they decided to do. Wario Odyssey. Like, I've never really enjoyed the whole, yeah, like, the micro-games stuff that they made Wario do. I just never really, it's... Like, a lot of it, like, a lot of it just seems like an excuse to, like, do callbacks to other Nintendo stuff, which is, you know, fine, whatever, but, like... I don't know. I like these Wario games. Like, these are just, like, fun. You're just running around killing sh Well, I guess, yeah, killing shit, but, like... How much of the level did I just skip?
But yeah, I, I agree. There definitely needs to like be like a new like Wario game, like in the love in the vein of like Wario Land 3, 4. Hell, even this one, because this one is uh was the first one where Wario wasn't just like being like Mario but bad, you know. He was like doing his own thing. Oh, damn it, I always do that. I destroy all the enemies and then there's like the little puffy dudes that you have to kill with an enemy because otherwise you, you can't shoulder tackle them. They'll just puff up. Stop that fucking train! More panels. That's like, that's gotta be four. But yeah, honestly, if they made an, like a, a new big Wario game where he could like transform like in these games, I think that would be literally amazing. Like, just so good. Because, like, in this game, you know, like, you get flattened or, like, caught on fire and stuff like that. It'd be so, so good. In town. Oh, this level is a slog. This is a very vertical level. We got these dudes that throw bottles at you of totally not booze. You get knocked down, you go all the way down. This reminds me of this, uh, the part of Wizards and Warriors on NES where you gotta climb this big ass castle and yeah, like you get hit and fall off or you like slip and fall, you go all the way down. All the way down. That's a baller ass game too. I've played I played it once on the channel like earlier, like early days. But great game. I mean it's not super vertical. There's like little separations like this, but Actually, no, I lied, because I think, like, the beginning of the level is back down there, so if we fall, we do, we go back to the beginning. And they sure do love to give you things to fall, possibly fall on. Those fucking birds. My greed knows no bounds. I want every coin I can. We gotta knock the stove off. I got a shoulder tackle to get over here. Maybe he needs that to go out the door. Oh. Fucker almost got me even though I was actively trying to avoid him. Hmm, 
what do we got in here? How about you go that way, bastard? If he ground pound and those little enemies are nearby, they'll um they'll turn around. camera would switch but no it didn't okay so now we're up here <laughs> crunch all right let's do, let's go do it again because I decided I wanted to, to ass stomp the freaking window dude which is completely unnecessary That's obviously the, the exit, but let's see what we got over here. Nintendo! I think that's, yeah, that's the, that's gotta be the treasure because it's not been anywhere else in the level. Every single damn coin I can get. <laughs> Aha, money! <laughs> Wario is like Mr. Krabs if Mr. Krabs went to the gym and wasn't a crab. <laughs> Could have been zero or eight, and I don't want to get these wrong, so yeah. That's also why I'm so adamant about getting as many coins as I can because some of these are just don't give you the the right information immediately. Down in the cellar. I think in the main uh, path, this is the first place you um, find the the uh, cake critter, cake guys. Feed me. Nom, 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 nom. Probably the way forward, so maybe I should go explore up for some treasures. Yeah. Oh! Kick dodge! Come here, cake bastard. I don't know what that character's name is, but for now, for now, it's Cake Bastard. Come here, Cake Bastard. <laughs> I 
a feeling I know I have a feeling I know how I have to do this. Let's get you here. Oh, he runs away. That's for putting, that's, that's for being a cake bastard. <laughs> All right, what do we got over here? Spring man. Well. Ah, but fucker got me. And he just turned around and just booped me right on the snoot with his hammer. Wario gets turned to spring man and sent to horny jail. <laughs> Spring of shame. <laughs> okay, that's just there. But I did see some other part that I might have ignored, so we'll, we'll head back here. We can kill the enemies again, it's not a big deal. Like, I see this. But how do I get there? Be like a later part of the level. I mean, we can we can turn the cake, Wario, and just kind of jump around. Maybe there's some weak floor somewhere, or maybe that's just the part of the level that you get to by a door. It probably is. All right, so that little area is cleared out. Destroy you. So we gotta go this way now that we're down here. Can't go that way, so we gotta send our ass through the floor. Oh, I need an enemy for that. Of course I do. Game loves doing that to me, by the way. Almost did it again. Try to do that, but damn, that's another cake snipe. Y'all see that? <laughs> I wish someone would cake, sni cake snipe me. Just, I'll be sitting there at my desk and I turn around and someone just like throws cake in my mouth. I, I, I would, I, I think I'd be alright with that. 
I was gonna say secret door, but then I got, I got, my mouth got full of cake very suddenly, so I, I couldn't focus. <laughs> okay, yeah, let's just get back to this part of the level. Or maybe to this part of the level I just haven't been to yet. Ooh, cake almost got me. game where the hell did you put make the cake guy go Cake snipe before I even knew I was getting before I even knew it. And I gotta clear up these little spaces to uh to escape. Ooh, secret door. made it all the way up with going just on the right side. <laughs> right? You're like, oh, I was gonna eat a salad today, and then this cake just jumps right in your mouth. Oh, God. No, no, no. Oh, yes. I was gonna eat healthy today. Oh, no. There's so much cake in my mouth. Ah. <laughs> Alright, put that one down, smash that one with my ass, and... Oh no! Almost in the butt! I was gonna try to jump over the cake. <laughs> I am too powerful for this world. Going down this way. Send me down, Cake Man. Thank <laughs> you. 
I don't necessarily know where I'm going this stage. I'm just kind of going. Hmm, are there any breaking wall things here? Doesn't seem like it. All right. Sometimes they do that. Like, they'll just have, you know, breakable walls. Well, there's the end of the stage, but I have a feeling there's, uh... Let's take this guy with us. Wait. Okay, that's where we've already been. Did I go through here? I don't know. No, I didn't. Okay, cool. Okay, I see what I gotta do. I got I gotta immolate myself. Alright, cool. More money. I like money. <laughs> Alright, feed me. I'm out running the little little football helmet guy. about to feed me while I'm trying to finish the stage. <laughs> okay. Okay. Okay, that's seven. So this next level we're going to have to play twice because as you see there's like a branching pathway situation here. Oh, this fucking factory level. I... Not a very fun level. There's just a lot going on. I mean, I guess you could say that can make it a fun level, but... First, we should probably look in here. Yeah, we gotta like. There's these switches here to reverse the f the direction of these uh, conveyor belts. made it out. Hmm. I think this I think this set was probably just to show you how it works cuz yeah. No way in hell we can uh Yeah, that was just a uh a, t a totally tutorial but not tutorial thing. Yeah, it was worth losing coins to try to go and get that. Like, 100%. Okay, that's the exit, but there's definitely more to it than that. We have to reverse, we have to reverse the uh, flow of the conveyor belts. Thank you. 
Okay, that reverses. I think with that you can technically leave the level now. Like I'll I'll kind of look, but yeah, you can literally just leave the level now if you want. But there's um, an alternate exit, and there's um, like other more coins to get by just kind of going around the level now. certain it's like one of these like n nuts in the floor like one of these nut blocks or whatever. <laughs> nut blocks <laughs> maybe it's not on this side but yeah I remember struggling as a child to find this yeah, it's probably on the other side because there's like no indi like for most of these secret exits like this there's like no real indication on like there being anywhere to go break or do first place. what's in here and then we'll go down there some more money probably I can, I can envision this being the uh, <clears throat> what you call it the uh, treasure of the not dungeon uh, place Oh, it, it's just over here. Yeah, well, enjoy. Keep it. Oh yeah, you gotta reverse the flow so you can actually like get out. <laughs> here the crevasse okay that's probably the way forward really how did I get hit by that of all fucking things yeah I probably should have just kept going to the left this probably uh, leads us back up top somewhere I mean, it gets us more coins, but we'll have to come back down. Yeah, it leads to this little spot that we previously weren't able to do anything with. So we're gonna have to go up and around again. That's okay. Not the end of the world. Okay. Let's... Ah, okay. So that's 
the second um, exit there. The alternate exit, rather. Well, that wasn't too bad. Alright. the alternate path. Um... Hmm. Let's just, let's like complete, complete this level. more involved than it, it may seem to do those slides like that. Very slightly. I'm not trying to say it's like super like mega big brain speedrun tech, but no, it's just a little tricky sometimes to get those uh, those slide squat things. I don't really know what they're called. Like power slide, I guess? Uh, whatever. Like it's gonna be a little the timing can be a little trickier than it may seem. of a different level where that had a... Uh, yeah, I think I was. Okay, so... That's the normal exit. Oh, no, it was over here where it has this little bit that I was thinking of. Okay. technically all we have to do to leave the level but I gotta grab some more some extra cash while we're in the level anyway because I mean that's kind of one of the big points of the game is getting as many coins as you can and who am I to and who am I to begrudge Wario of getting some more coins Surprise, motherfucker! <laughs> Especially because it's just fun just destroying blocks. Okay, yeah, this side, that little side's done.
we can kind of just... Really? Mario's hitbox is just massive, I guess. Surprise! <laughs> I think I already got the money over here. I guess we're getting it again, or going over here again, rather. That's uh, this that's this level in its entirety, both the the alternate exit and the uh, normal exit. And those coins just go directly into our pocket because we already got the thing for this level. Because we had to play it twice to get both exits. All right, and. Anyone for this is a boss level where you play basketball. <laughs> it's fucking weird, but everything Wario does is just weird. So it's not exactly super unexpected. W Wario no basket. <laughs> Funny you say that though, because I think there's like at least one Wario game that never came to the States where he like has like a bucket or something. It's, it seems like really fucking weird. Oh, fucking bird. Perish. Okay, this is the fail state area of the boss fight. I remember this boss being ridiculous. Like, not like really necessarily difficulty, but like. Like, it just being ridiculous. In concept. <laughs> oh, bastard. Oh, that's just that way anyway, but I think there was some stuff in the first part of the level I just kind of skipped. Okay, there wasn't much, but hey. Coins are coins. Alright, so that area is clear out. Uh, oh damn, I just got bottle sniped. Jesus Christ. And weird ass. I don't even know what kind of creature that is throwing the bottles. But they, they got a good eye. What we got up here? Oh, treasure! Nice, all right. Okay, so we go in here. I'm pretty sure the, um, yeah, the boss is just here, but pretty sure the secret exit is through here with some other enemy destroyable blocks that are not um, shown. Cause some, like, like, we'll just test that. Yeah, like, those aren't labeled as enemy destroy blocks, but they all, they, but they most certainly are. How much, 
is it literally just down this? It's literally right here. All right. We'll come back to that. That's pretty. That's a pretty easy one to get to. thing left to do is go into this boss fight and see how if I remember how to fight him because it's been years <laughs> yep there's a rabbit let's play basketball yep you turn the enemy into a basketball <laughs> come here little bastard This is fucking absurd. I love I love how ridiculous this is. Oh no! No! Not like this! You get turned into a basketball as well! That's so stupid, I love it. Like, they just had a good time making ridiculous bosses for this game, and I, I applaud them for that. It's fun when the game doesn't take itself too horribly seriously. That's probably, that's probably too. Yeah, that's, abs I probably should have stopped or sooner, but yeah, whatever. Okay, that means 15 levels to go, and then the game's done. Alright. And down this way is the canon ending. Quote, unquote, like the, like, OG ending, but... Uh, let's see what's here. I can't remember which path this is. Better get on the thing. Oh shit! Asshole! <laughs> Son of a bitch. That's what these ice enemies do. They spit icicles at you and if you get hit you get you start just sliding. Ah. 
Damn it. <laughs> oh. Oh, alright, cool. <laughs> Motherfucker. Now we go even farther when we fail. Yay, I love failing. Oh, fuck boy, oh boy just despawn. Alright. Oh, you're, you're the one up here anyway. That, that works. Tricky moving enemies around. Damn it. In the ass, get up there. Get up there, you snowy fuck. <sighs> Come on, it's 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 cool. Don't worry about it. It's 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 not cool just because these they're ice creatures. It's cool because whatever. It's not that big of a deal. We'll just do this a bit. We'll just. Yep, there we go. I should have just did that in the first place. Whatever. <laughs> it's cool. You got to saw me be. You get to see. You had to, got to see me be a fool in real time HD. Oh, for what? Like 80 coins, maybe? Like, not very many coins. <laughs> but it's fine. Oh, okay. It's this little fishing dude again. That coin is. Very obviously differently colored. Wait, did I already go through this door? Oh, I, yeah, I definitely did. See what this one leads me to. Maybe it leads me to some coins or something. Nope, just a punk ass fish. No, that's literally the beginning of the level, so yeah, that was not a good one to, to touch. Yeah, there wasn't much up here, but yeah, you know what, it's fine. Whee!
Alright, what's down here? Oh, this is awful. Why would you why would you do this? I mean, it's not impossible to get by, but it's just like mm, that's a little annoying. But no, it's cool. Got it. Just got a shoulder tackle your way to victory. Oh, <laughs> that's mean. That's so mean. What's, let's see what's in this door. Oh. Nothing I care about. It's wanted to bully the little guy. Oh, hey, there's the boss. In big air quotes. That one's the treasure room. That one's the boss. What's... I'm guessing this one is just gonna get us up here to get some coins. Which hey, is the, like, the prime directive of the game is get treasure, get coins, get treasure, but you know. Alright, I think we're about done in this stage. I mostly just wanted to make sure you get that little spinning black coin that comes out of the boss because that's like 50 or 100 extra coins. I can't remember which one it is. Okay. It's probably two. Uh, yeah, it's absolutely two. That's the only number that has that configuration. the factory thing. The drunk enemies, we haven't had them in a while. Oh, 
Oh, looks like I got a little stuck, huh? I think the ones you find randomly in levels are are 100, but the ones from those bosses are maybe 50, because that one definitely gave me 100 that time. Okay, so don't really need to go that way again. You have to if you get if you get hit by the drunk ball, though, because that's the only place where there's water. So that's kind of like a the fail state for the, uh, for this. Oh. Or if you just, if you're just bad at the game, let's kill these fucking ducks or whatever they are. I don't really know. I would kill, probably, probably not going to make it in there. We can try a few more times though. Nah, I think our jump gets. Yeah, never mind. Not, not, don't have a good angle for it. You think, therefore, you are. Bold statement. <laughs> Saying I think. Ah, they want us to float around. Go away, bat. This level is just full of those like, like failure state kind of uh, areas. Okay, can't go that way. It's this. I'll oh, just park the level. Okay, that's not neither. Oh boy, everyone's favorite. Electric death mazes. With little star spike dudes. Like go with the bird and you'll have like a bit of a invincibility frames and there you go. Alright, let's get out of this fucking hole. Okay, yeah, that was the bottom area of this. Woo! Almost got hit in the face of the fucking bottle. Okay. So we definitely need to be flat, at least in some manner. What about there? What's this? Oh, really? They didn't really hide it very well in this level. Maybe they ran out of ideas. And they're like, you know what? Fuck it, here. <laughs> yeah, we definitely have to be flat. I was supposed to not get unflattened there. I see. I see. All 
All right, smash me. Step on me, a little bat. <laughs> Oh shit. Well, I'm, that means I'm probably screwed. Nope. Can't get at that angle, Lalameo. <laughs> I like the little bat's expression. It's like, oh, you hit me. Alright, bye. <laughs> Let's try this again. Oh shit, well, I screwed up immediately. <laughs> Those coins really were a very good guide of where to like float to, and I got the coins, so, um, now I gotta kind of remember where those were and try to float at that angle so I can, uh, manage that you can see how much thinking I'm not doing because I'm having to do this like several times there's not much thought going on right now other than float survive don't get hit by bottle gets get stepped on All right, that's, you just kind of step off and then float back. That's pretty easy. Okay, you jump to get the bat to not pick you up. Now we pancake our asses up here. And I don't think I can really jump, so we're gonna just kind of float, I guess. Ah. to not fucking fall all- God, no! Fucker! <laughs> you little bastard. Head very flat, yep. Well, I messed up anyway. Because the little bat s snatched me. for not getting nabbed but that's pretty tight if you're a little slow you just kind of get well nabbed damn it damn it no I jumped just a little too slow well I, I, I was gonna try to like jump and bounce up there but yeah that's no way in hell I'd be getting that through there anyway this is a little trickier than than I thought it was going to be, but that's okay. This is one of the bonus chapters, so it's a little bit more um, technical than the rest of the game. I 
Like, I'm 90% sure I'm not gonna be able to get to where those coins are without coming up here and just gonna... Go! Oh! Yes. Let's... Please, let me free from this hell. <laughs> And just so that I never have to do this level again, we're gonna play and just let it play through. I'm not even gonna guess. Oh, what number is it? Mmm. I'll never know. They're gonna make it really easy now, aren't they? Yeah, oh, I wonder what number it could be. Whoa, I think I recognize that one. <laughs> I win! Yeah, I just don't want to have to play that level ever fucking again. That was tedious. Not hard, just very not fun to have to like get that angle like that. Move through the water. Well, <laughs> at least it, it's it's accurate to what you're gonna have to do in the level, I guess. It's like me making stream titles. Like, move through the water. Oh, alright. Well, at least... I mean, not specifically moving through the water right this second. Okay, that wasn't that groundbreaking of a secret. I was like, ooh, secret! And then it's... And that just comes back over here. Fucking duck pirate ass. I'm gonna turn you into mulch. There's an arrow on the wall pointing this way, so I'm, sh I'm sure I probably gotta go this way, you know? It, it, makes, it makes sense to me. Oh, I, I, fu I fucked it up. I fucked it up, I fucked it up. Oh god, where am I going? <laughs> ah, so that's how the level's connected together. I mean, um, it makes sense. The whole the whole level's just like pipes or whatever. That's what I get for just killing the enemies preemptively without doing any sort of a. Uh... Oh, okay. So we have to turn the faucets off. Listen to me, the giant arrow. Okay, that's this is annoying too. Damn it. Game, you know I'm going to go after those coins. You know, I'm go I kind of have to. Oh, well, I technically got him, but I lost a few in the process. Well, you know what? It's fine. It's cool. Ah, no! <laughs> Damn it. Not like this. Shit! <laughs> the 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 these enemies are specifically put in place for this to happen. You get hit, you go all the way back past a different one. And then you get hit again, and you lose more coins. Oh, I missed a coin. 
Ooh, ooh, Mr. Coin. Ooh, Mr. Coin. Ooh, Mr. Coin. Ooh, there's a coin. Ooh, Mr. Coin. in here somewhere. Okay, this one wants us to turn water on. Whoa, this is just like the water temple. In Ocarina of Time, you're, pl you're messing with water. <laughs> ah, okay. So now we can get in this door. Spring dude, no thank you. Although I have a feeling I'm probably gonna need it. I have a feeling this is one of those cases where, like, the spring can be helpful, but it might also just get in your fucking way, because... Yeah, you specifically need the spring to get... You either need the spring or you need this enemy. Alright. We're in. run around and bounce yourself off of like the walls like a kid eating sugar telling lies no papa open wide <laughs> <laughs> no I'm not okay <laughs> Thanks for asking! <laughs> well now we got that broken, we don't need those little fire dudes anymore. Let's uh, figure out what's going on in here. Now that I changed that, maybe we can get some more coins! I'm feeling this is like the, uh, yeah, it's this. Could care less. I just want money. I just want the money! Just out of spite, <laughs> just turn them, turn them into money. All right, cool.
Okay, that's nine. I was, I was thinking it's either five or nine. Shock the owl! Oh god. Is this whole level just flying around these flight mazes? I have a feeling it is! Here. Is it like, is it like some, some sort of owl convention? It's like OwlCon. Just a bunch of owls in like this weird factory full of just electric, like electricity squares. <laughs> There's the big arrow again. It's you, Neki. The big arrow. <laughs> I guess I should have said this stream guest starring Nicora Ray, the big arrow. <laughs> Bubbles. I'm sure, this didn't wake something in someone as a kid. Surely not. No, it's totally not. Oh, it's just it's just money. Okay, these cannons only like are worth ten coins a piece. I thought they were worth more, like twenty, but no. Oh, now we got to get out with our ill-gotten gains. Damn it! <laughs> it, it, the arrow is just pointing us to, to some sweet loot, which, I mean, I'll take sweet loot. It's also t probably telling us to go this way, because that's kind of where we go up from, I think. Or up to, rather. And it's like, you're showing me the way. Oh, fucking electricity dudes. Little weird, like, lightning bears or whatever they are. I have no idea what their the enemy name would be. in it, like, a lot of coins. Oh, 
I'm coming for your coin. Oh, well, I probably despawned when it went off screen, but it's like, I'm coming for your coin. One singular coin. Just, just jump down several stories for one dollar. Or, I'll, I don't know what the equivalent would be in Wario, or in the Mario universe. Like, is, is a coin like a cent? Is it like a dollar? Is it like not even that? Like, what's the uh, conversion rate? <laughs> I'm sure some big brain YouTuber person has done some like, well, this is how much money Mario money is worth. And it's like, all right, cool. <laughs> well, there's um. Seems too easy. Or they just impressed they got through the like the lightning maze. And they're like, okay, here's the exit. I mean I'm I mean I, I know I impress myself by doing very easy tasks, but you know. Oh. Holy crap, I just realized we have like six hundred coins in this level. That's all that's a few. I think uh, we got like one of those uh, black, uh, like rare coins as well. So we probably only have like 500 something otherwise, but hey, I'll take money. Oh, I heard, I heard money. Ha ha ha, sneaky bastards. I saw some other coins too. Maybe we do this. Oh, we do do that. Do we do do? Do do that. All right. Well, at least they didn't hide the uh, tr the treasure for this level like in the maze. That would have been obnoxious. But 701 coins in one level. That's impressive. Like I probably don't even need to do guess this one. That's probably two. Yeah, it's two. I say as I like just guess it without really trying. Okay, so. We have 11 left, so if we can get, um, like, 5,000 coins, we don't even have to play that mini game anymore. Just let it do its thing. Awaiting syrup. I mean, she ran into this factory. Ooh, treasure. And other than that, other than that one level that was a bit tedious, this one's not. This like zone hasn't been that bad. In the grand scheme of things, it's been pretty uh, doable. Maybe this level will change my mind, but oh, we got we got drunk drunk Wario time. Perish. Oh, yep, we're drunk. Too much sake. if I need this enemy for something, but... Oh, well... <laughs> I hope not, because... I just murdered him. Murderized him. Ah, well, there's the money. Oh, this guy's dead, too. <laughs> A little weird drunk duck.
Oh, well, here's the boss room. Well, all right. Well, I guess let's see what's going on here. Oh, uh, there she is in her weird flying thing. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing here. Oh, I guess smashing into her fucking thing. Oh, now she's pissed, I think. I don't know what's going on. What? What is this? Do I jump on it? I do, and... Oh, it's a bomb. Oh, well, all right, I guess that's what happens. So I probably had to throw it at her. I just didn't throw it high enough. Well, I guess we could explore more of the level, so. Not a big deal. Oh, I got a little bit more money too, so. All right, let's try it again. These levels don't tend to have a lot of money in them anyway, so we just gotta. We just gotta bully her. I'm guessing I had to throw it up at her. Oh, well, maybe... <laughs> oh, well, yep, yeah, that's what you gotta, you just gotta chuck that piece of shit. Oh, sneaky fucker, alright. I should have, uh, maybe not just jumped right at it, but, you know. That's okay. Like the only co the only consequences are really uh, you have to come back. It's pretty tame. And we know we can just speed run this part here where we just bully her. Well, I say as I lose. <laughs> Looks like I was the one that was bullied. <laughs> Oh, that's pretty quick to get back up here, like 20 seconds, maybe. Okay, here comes this thing, let's... Well, well let's maybe do it a little better this time. Okay. This one's this one's gonna go high, I bet. Oh. Oh. Okay. So I think its height depends on your head, maybe. The height that seemed different that time than last time. So I think you have to like let it kind of decide where it's gonna go and then react. Okay. Let's see. Let's see if I can use my brain for once. Oh, well, <laughs> just... Okay, so, yeah, I have to... Okay, probably one more, and this one's probably just... Oh! Sneaky motherfucker! Okay, that's actually a little tricky. <laughs> they get they get real aggressive, huh? I like this boss. It's uh, interesting. It's more dynamic than just jump on its head and kill it to death. Oh, the first part of the fight is just like bully, bully her, bully. <laughs> And he had to like delip like deliberately throw that upwards. 
Alright. Okay. Oh, wow. Got me again. Alright. Yeah, you gotta, like, kind of, like... I guess you have to, um... Man, I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. I'm just playing the game. But I would assume you have to um, let it, like, kind of decide where it's gonna try to slam at, jump, and then land on it all, like, kind of at the same time. So you can pull it off. We'll see. Play the game, but I'm trying, Neki! There's not an arrow to show me the way! <laughs> Oh, shit. Oh. How am I supposed to live, laugh, and love in these conditions? There's not, an air, there's not a clear arrow to show me where I'm supposed to go. Oh, oh. Alright. One hit down. Now we got... This one is a little spicier. Not by much. Oh, shit. But it is a little spicier. It doesn't always go at the same height. Oh! Like that. Yeah, I should have, uh, just let that one fly, but... Yeah, the second one's a little tricky, and then the third one, I've still not been able to figure out. I mean, the third one, once we do, we'll probably win the fight, so... We we'll only need to figure it out once. <laughs> I gotta get good. Oh, I was not paying attention. I don't know what I was thinking of, but it wasn't apparently the boss. <laughs> Fuck's sakes. I was just, I, I, I zoned out just completely and was like, oh, hey, she's gonna like spawn soon, right? And then, yeah, just, um, just immediate, just egg on my face. Time to get good! <laughs> Don't bully me, Neki. I'm, I'm, I have one brain cell and it's not, I guess, apparently not thinking about this boss fight. Alright, now, time to do this again. Oh, just barely, okay. Alright, we're just gonna let that one break, cause... Yeah, I... Alright, there we go. See, that wasn't so bad. Kind of like just the weirdness of that, the, like the randomness of the, uh, the bombs. <clears throat> this is probably gonna be the last one we have to actually maybe guess on, but I think it's, it's, it's probably five. No, it's nine. I, I, I would have just got it wrong if I guessed five. Because after this one, there's only 10 stages left and they would cost uh, 450 a piece. So we literally don't even have to press anything of those anymore. We just kind of let them finish. <laughs> I love the goofy little cutscenes of them just getting launched to fucking space. And the warrior's like, got my treasure back! Alright, so that's one of the other endings. The old boy's just probably carrying his treasure over his head like a fucking Chad. Somewhere. Yep, there he is! He's like, I'm just gonna carry this all in one hand above my head as I run back. Oh, 
Oh, the, the owl's holding the treasure now. <laughs> the, the owl's like, dude, I can't carry both of you. What the fuck? <laughs> well, I kind of can. It looked like it was slowly dipping down originally. I can see the little transparency in Wario's outfit there. At least in this uh, instance. A lot of these older Game Boy games would use the transparency color as black. That the owl deserves a race. No, no shit, right? But yeah, a lot of these older like games like this would use the transparency color, which defaults to black, I think, as you know, black. And that's why a lot of these older games have like just like white backgrounds or black backgrounds or whatever, because then it won't matter. And they could have the other thing as like a different color or something. Of course, since this is like a color game now, it doesn't exactly work, so they probably had to either change it or just make it like not that way to begin with. Dude, dude, dude is fucking fit. Don't believe the cake thrower guy's lies. This guy's fucking warrior's fucking thick. And fit. <laughs> he, he's just big boned. <laughs> hey, those are the little birds that live outside of Wario's castle. My question is what the fuck's going on with the sun? I never really thought about it, but yeah, that sun's fucked up. There are the birds. <clears throat> Barbs. Hooray. And... Alright, let's do a reset. Oh god. <laughs> Alright, that path's done. So, this level... The, the basketball rabbit one has the alternate path that you unlock. I'm not, I'm not even gonna really get too much more money, at least in this level, just because we just need to... Like, we just gotta get to, uh... So you gotta get up in here. And get this little spearman up here. And I guess we should get the money that's up here, because it's like literally right here. And then we break these. That are uh, very not very obviously like the enemy blocks because like they're not labeled as such so you would never like guess oh I should throw an enemy here yep that's the uh, <laughs> the alternate exit for this level is just kind of behind the boss door it took me a long time to find that shit as a kid if I ever did find it on my own probably not honestly 
<clears throat> Alright, now we can go to probably the worst levels in the game. And they're a spooky, scary, haunted house! Suddenly. She's... Captain Syrup is a bit of a girl boss, though. <laughs> Enemy mobs is her right to this is abuse! Like, oh shit! Go, 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 go. <laughs> Mario is like, ah! Do I have to? Fine. Uncanny Mansion. Defeat the giant spearman. And the music is excellent, but like, just. Like, the, the aesthetics are excellent, and the music's great, but, like, these levels can be a, a pain in the ass. Okay, we entered out, we exited, now there's chickens! Massive chickens. Um, I think there are ghosts actually in this in some of the levels of these That turned you into the zombie uh, That turned you into the zombie Wario or whatever Okay, yeah, we got a Giant chicken oh, There's all these these little vampire dudes Now, these are the levels I was talking about where, like, later on, the these, uh... These, uh, zombie dudes would, uh, kind of be here to cause you strife. Because, as you can see, if you turn- if you get turned to zombie warrior, yo, you pass through platforms, and that is... Quite frequently not very much fun. Surely there's like a door over here somewhere. Or s just trying to figure. Up oh, there it is. Oh, it's just this. Not enough coins. Fuck you. Fuck you, game. <laughs> I didn't want that anyway. Anyway, we got now we've got these things. <laughs> For whatever that's worth. I'm guessing we have to go in this door then. I can't. Oh, hey, hey, here, here are your fucking booze. <laughs> well, they're not really booze, but, you know, whatever. If you touch them, you tur get turned into a zombie. And then you have to probably redo the platforming challenge because you pass through platforms as the, z as the zombie. Good, good enough. <laughs> They're booze in spirit. Get it? Cause they're ghosts. <laughs> oh, damn it! Well, there you go. That's what happens when you get hit by them. You get turned to a zombie, and then you fall all the way to the bottom of the fucking stage. <laughs> Thankfully, we need when you get touched by the light of day. You get turned back to normal Wario for whatever reason. Oh, here's the boss. Oh, 
Oh, that, that slide underneath the ghost? Yeah, that was pretty fucking hype, not gonna lie. Yeah, I will, I'm not gonna take, I'm gonna try to get these levels done as fast as possible, because they are, uh... They are tedious. I think it's one. Yeah, it's one. I'll say no, I could just like, let the, the, the coins pay out for these ones, but if it's just like one, and I can tell it's just one, you know, I'm just gonna... We're gonna push try to finish this thing, this stream, and I don't think I'm gonna go back and get all the treasures, cause that's, eh, no thanks, but I at least wanna finish that little panel because yeah. Oh, there's an owl! He's trapped! These damn star things. Hmm, what's in here? Like, we've got more than enough coins to just, like, do all the thingies for the rest of the game. Like, all those, uh, little uh, thingamajigs. The, um, panels. We don't have to really get any more coins if we don't want to. I mean, we're gonna, because, I mean, they're in the way. Okay, Owl has been freed. Come with me, Owl. You'll, the only thing you have to lose are your chains. <laughs> is like cut very short. Eh, I could get those coins but I literally don't have to. Uh, I'll still grab coins because the, the, the sound is pleasant. There's a pleasant sound when you pick up coins. But I'm not gonna like go out of my way for like like secret caches of coins unless like it's fun to do so. Ooh, that's a big old spider. possible I will grab the big ones just because their, their sounds even their, they sound even nicer when you pick them up plus they're just big big coin <laughs> all right what we got 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 more spikes up no coins there's an owl sorry I woke you up Oh. 
right. What we got? What we got? What we got? What we got? Oh, that seems counterintuitive what I would want. Maybe? I don't really know. <laughs> did I even come this way? I don't know if I did. Where, where is this? Where am I? Whose pants are these? <laughs> Where's my grandson? <laughs> Don't know if I needed to hit that, but I did. Things like coins like this, I really enjoy going after. There's an owl in here. Why is there an owl in here? Who lo who put you in here, little owl? That's rude. I mean, a lot of money, so I can't really complain. But you know, okay. So me and my brother are gonna do lunch, but I'm gonna keep the stream running just while we do lunch and then after that's done I'll be back. So just hang tight, check back in like 10, 20 minutes or so. I'm just gonna keep the stream running because I want to finish this game today. And then after that I'll probably stop the stream and kind of get like water or something like that. And then we'll start with RimWorld after that. But for now, yep, I'm gonna mute my mic and we'll just keep going well I'll probably put like the BRB screen on because I think I do have one I just never use it <laughs> so yeah I'm gonna mute my mic and put the BRB screen on and I'm gonna make lunch so I'll be back in a bit Thank you. 
This is Neki. And you are now watching my stream. Today we'll be playing Wario Gam. This is my favorite level. It is very purple and we can't really see Wario. Gosh darn, I was so close with that jump. Next is the boss room. Silly mechanics but enjoyable. Again, the purple block most of our view, adding challenge. But I think we can prevail.
Did you know this game was made by one person? They even composed the music by blending multiple automatones tracks. Truly a talented individual. Cannot get any more good than this, Mavis. This is the peak performance I can achieve by playing with my toes.
for joining my stream, let's raid Mavis. Be nice with them, everyone. See you next time. Bye bye. Alright, we are back for real. <laughs> Thank you for your patience. I was normally would just like in the stream, but we're pretty close to just finishing the game, so I kinda just want to finish what I wanted to do with the game. Excuse me. <clears throat>
<laughs> We're just gonna end this level. <laughs> <clears throat> Go through the um the rest of the level. And find a switch. Well, it's set down. <clears throat> I didn't know they could throw at that angle. because usually you have to kind of just like avoid these enemies whenever they're like this but like no we're just plowing through them and murder, my favorites. Excuse me? Asshole thing. <clears throat> no, it's just this fucking thing. Nope, not interested. I feel like this is the one we have to go into, uh... Whatever, I'll just take some damage. Yeah, this is the one we had to go into to do this. Level, you just have to figure out like how the, to get manipulate the doors, which wasn't not really that hard. <clears throat> Pretty 
sure that's seven. Back is difficult. I have a feeling this is the level I didn't like in this, uh, like, er this area. Oh wow, that's unlikely. <laughs> Alright, cool. That's why I always try to destroy as many blocks as I can. Not only because it's just kind of fun, but Jesus Christ, that's some... Yeah, you can get those uh, rare spawn coins like that. Three in the same level. Odds of that don't seem like they're very high. I don't know the. I don't like. Don't know like the odds of getting one of those coins to appear. <clears throat> I guess we could go in here. There's probably a switch somewhere. <laughs> turns the lights off too, fuck. Well, at least there's some enemies so you can kind of see where you're going. I gotta bounce off this and make it back up here. Of course. <clears throat> can come from. I'm a bitch, really. <laughs> it's like a not very fun placed enemy. All right, I'll, let's go into this uh, middle door here then. <clears throat> oh, there's a ghost! was hiding in the dresser. <laughs> I mean, 
mean, the name of the level is going back is difficult, so you have to kind of like figure out how you can gonna go back to where you wanted to go. Let's see what's in here. Oh, I'm not even trying to find these. Oh, Jesus Christ, what? Money! <laughs> That's annoying. Exit, but I want to get all the money I can. That's kind of the point of the game, you know? Oh. <clears throat> Although that's probably about all I'm going to get in this level. That's a lot of cool. Granted, 300 of that basically came from just random chance, so. Get jumped, ghost. Either one or seven. It's one. I, but I want to ride the ghost. Ooh, woo. Sometimes you just gotta ride a ghost. Capture the ghost. Oh, we're gonna capture the ghost. Jesus Christ.
Okay, that's this is where the boss sends us when we fail. Not if, when. <laughs> Cause I can't remember if this boss is e easier or harder than the final boss. Probably, I guess we'll find out. another little switch room. It is. And what do we have in here? Oh. Well, there's the boss room. how hard this boss is because I cannot remember oh yeah the ghost catches her and now we gotta fight the ghost not her I just don't remember what that entails oh oh hello cloudy welcome back oh <laughs> well, that's gonna be annoying. That's okay. Oh, do I have to redo this every time I lose to the boss? That's slightly tedious. Eh, it could be worse. Let's try to get good. I should have known it would just go there again, but... Oh, no, I, I don't have to do that every time. I think I might have just accidentally hit it when I was going through one of the other rooms. Alright, let's try this again. <laughs> let's see where it shows up. Oh, motherfucker. Okay, it does track you. It, 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 it seemed like it didn't, but it it does track you, so you have to kind of be moving around a little bit to kind of not get get snatched up. Well, at least you don't really lose anything other than um, the will to live <laughs> fighting these bosses. <laughs> Oh, you're fast now. Okay, so the third hit, after the first two hits, the, the speed goes up. It's probably also smarter to not, to not be on the table. Oh, well. oh. oh, you still got me? Bullshit. Whatever. 
again, it's very low stakes, so you just go back to the boss fight. Christ, that was my time. My reaction speed is like a like a, a drunk snail. So we might be here for a bit. the button uh, it just didn't uh, charge oh you are real f oh he's very red <laughs> he got very red <laughs> I imagine that's probably the last hit most of these bosses don't have many more than like three or four uh, life to them so we just gotta get good as the kids say Bitch. I wonder if they switched that that position automatically or if it's because I was near there. Hard to say. It's kind of seemed like both, but not both at the same time. It's hmm. Oh well. Son of a gun. Alright, well. Maybe it's better not to be on the ground. At first I was like, oh, it's better to be on the ground because then they have farther up to drop, but it's conversely problematic to get caught like that like I did, because otherwise I might be able to might have been able to jump over the ghost. Hard not to get snatched. <laughs> I was like dashing everywhere, like, trying to be elusive, trying to be trying to be like water on a duck's back. But then I ended up running down its ass crack, and you no, know, that wasn't very eloquent, was it? <laughs> Gold star, you tried the thing. <laughs> uh, I mean, this isn't like hard. It's just annoying because the patterns are kind of annoying. Like it comes out from an angle. Not very many enemies in this game do that. See, I think I think after you get the first hit, it does start tracking you directly. I think the first um, phase, it does that one spot on the right, and then a spot to the kind of to the left. So. so we'll test that. I'm gonna stand right here, and we'll see what happens. 
Oh, it does. Uh, motherfucker, I'm wrong. It does track you in the first phase. Uh, I love being wrong on live TV. <laughs> I mean, it's been a long time since I played this game, so I'm, I'm honestly surprised I remember how to get to all these secret exits. Oh, you have a- oh, okay, we won. See? Easy! I'm gonna- I'm gonna put the controller down and take a drink of my Canada to dry here. We have more enough coins to just kinda do this for the rest of them. So I'm probably gonna just do that, cause, yeah. Okay, and then we just have the final five stages and the normal pathway to finish. <laughs> Look at all the treasures! just fell and fell and fell was it all just a nightmare maybe I don't know <laughs> a little ambiguous Get that bitchin' hot air balloon, though. They sure f they sure flying. If you ever seen some low poly birds, those are some pretty low poly birds. <laughs>
birds. They're just living their best life. Oh! I think that means that this whole thing was a nightmare. This whole last, like, level was like a nightmare that Wario had. <laughs> or something. I don't know. It, it doesn't matter, really, but... It's kind of funny to think of stuff. Yep, there's the one that's always fucking late. <laughs> <laughs> that one's always fucking late. So yeah, I think I think the whole thing there was like a nightmare Wario was having. And that preceded the actual um Okay, we'll do a reset because it's just gonna sit here and say end. Alright. And now we've got the rest of the normal pathway to go through. Hello, Ventus. Good afternoon. We are finishing up Wario Land 2 today. We have five more levels to beat. I opted not to get treasure playing it this time because getting the treasure is kind of annoying. But I figured just playing all the levels and showing the game off is fun because it is a fun game. I needed to bring that little uh, enemy with me. It looks like the yeah, little fire dude. Oh no! Like didn't like need to, but but I guess to get some more money, which Wario Wario loves money, and I like mo I like mo Wario getting money, so. Very carefully bring this end little fire bastard with us. Missing something here? Was this, just, was this just to get for a monetary gain? Because I mean, I'm about that, but like, you know. Oh, I probably just could skip this door entirely. Sounds about right. I'm just like.
Ooh, get juked. I really don't need to be getting any more coins because we have a lot in reserve for the last uh, few levels worth of uh, the flippy things, but... Who am I to deny Wario his monetary gain? Probably up if I don't run right into the damn thing, huh? <laughs> Makes it a lot easier to fly around on the owl when you don't run right into the enemies. Right into him. That's what you get for running, for existing in my way. You get turned into a coin. fire blocks that aren't labeled. I mean, why else would they have this little fire dude here? Right in the ass. It's probably just the treasure. And I do not care. We're way too far gone to care about that now. <laughs> I had to very quickly decide when I first started was I going to go after the treasure or not because if you don't go after it the first time you're going through the level you have to go back and play the level again and some of these levels are obnoxious Bonk <laughs> Bad Bad Wario Oh gee I wonder what number it is I, I figured it was a one, but you can just let the game just uncover all of them. We have enough coins to get the rest of them that way, so. Eh. Yeah. We find all the little branching pathways and stuff. Storm the castle. She came to our castle and, and re-stole her treasure back, but now it's time to go to her castle and steal, re-steal re her stolen treasure back. Because in Wario Land 1, you steal her treasure. Oh, damn it! I didn't want to become the string monstrosity, but I'm bad at the game. Uh, spring. I probably said, uh, I probably said, uh, sp I probably misspoke. It is a spring monstrosity.
Yeah, I probably said the wrong word because my brain is uh, mush. Oh, this is one of the very few areas you get to play as the, the little Wario. <laughs> little little shit Wario. Very rare um, debuff. Well, that was fun while it lasted. Wonder if some other stuff up top that I could have got. Now I gotta leave and come back and get turned little again. Oh. I'm not even trying to find these damn things. <laughs> that one coin is totally worth it. <laughs> Fuck you, bird. I love wall money, just like I love wall chicken, you know? So, something about being from the wall makes it taste better. <laughs> Oh god damn it, I need the Oh well there's like ten of them down here, so Rude. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Alright, fine. Have it, your, have it your way. We'll destroy those two. Oh. 
Well, that's the end of the level, but there's another door we can go through. It's easy to switch this, so I don't really mind. Turn around. Gotcha. <laughs> Oh, we can just end the level anyway after we go through this, so that works. Oh, this fucking room. Probably gonna be six. Yeah, it's six. Whee! Hi, worm. Were you drinking sink water again like the cretin you are? <laughs> Big ol' kitty. Likes drinking water from the, the faucet. Defeat four ducks. Oh boy, four ducks. Oh no, I bet this is the level I've been thinking of. It's like really annoying, like kind of tedious platform with these ghosts. Yep, this is the level I was thinking of. Oh, I just had to get the coins in, I. <laughs> At least these little ghosts don't like take your coins, you just kind of. inconvenience you. I'm even go out, going after the coins. I don't need them. I have already have more than enough. Well, there's first. There's one duck. Smash him with my big ass. All right. Duck one is destroyed. Get juked, fucking ghost. Doing them more just because I can. Oh, the duck is just down here. Okay.
Oh, well, that's pretty simple. That one was, anyway. break all these because I can right on its head and it's dead. Okay, go here again. Alright, I am back. I was helping roommate open windows and stuff because it's get some fresh air in the house. Punk ass bird.
the other dock. But my thirst for my first my thirst for money continues. Come here, stinky. I'm getting out of that, so. Kablam! Got him! <laughs> All ducks destroyed. I think it is either eight or zero, but it just wouldn't kept not giving me the middle. All right, we got two more levels. Find the hidden door. Oh boy. Oh, I think I remember this level. There's a lot of smashing, like part just parts of the castle. Her castle, rather. A glove, wall breaking stuff. Yeah, just make sure my roommate wasn't asking me for something or something like that. Yep! Oh, 
<laughs> Not that there's like really any real consequence behind it, but it's just kind of funny that like I stepped right and I hopped right off into a spike trap. <laughs> Stuff down there, okay. up there that I'm not able to reach. There we go. Now I feel better about myself. <laughs> Just kidding. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I want to say there's something over here. It seems like a just large area. So this room was just extra money. Fine by me. Asshole. Asshole fish. Well, more like asshole bird, but it's an asshole bird spitting asshole fish.
money. Oh. Well, I guess that's the end of the level, but there's almost certainly more treasures to be found. usually that hard to find they're just kind of out they're just a little off the beaten path but if you're like like if you're determined to find them you'll find them I mean I think that's about all this level has to offer is stuff we've already seen almost certainly a four. After we beat this, I'll probably like take like 15, 20 minutes to just kind of get set up for the next stream, and we'll be doing our Rim World. Or bastard respawned on me.
coming out. Water here, which means one thing. These motherfuckers. These bastards. These. Whatever they are. I don't know what they are. Are they Kappas? I don't really under know what they are. What. What they're meant to represent. God damn it. So we gotta we gotta use one of them as a battering ram for those blocks over there. Probably not that one. Freaking thumbs like sweaty because it's been it's been on this little D-pad the entire time we've been playing, just moving it around and stuff, you know. Ooh, oh wow! Well. Is this where the the treasure thingy is? Yeah, it is. Good for them. See if we fail the first time. Probably. Okay, yeah, I gotta like. I love how goofy all the enemies are in this game. Damn it! What you gotta do? That's what you gotta do. Okay, we won. And she's just burned to death. <laughs> well, alright. Thanks for the treasure, I guess. <laughs> That was 
Yeah, that one was way easier than the ghost. Alright, it, it, it's, it's one. There's no other number that could be. Look at all those extra coins we had, too. I don't know what that even does for you. I can't even remember, but... That's all the levels beaten in this game. Well, baseline beaten. I didn't get the treasure in any of them, really, but that's fine. <laughs> there they go, Team Rocket style. <laughs> so, so Oreo stole back the treasure he originally stole from her. <laughs> and he's just gonna head home now. Sometimes you just gotta steal, I guess. <laughs> oh, that owl's gonna... Is earning its pay, I guess, or it probably doesn't get paid. I mean, that's an owl. What's it gonna spend money on? Dead mice? Probably. <laughs> if I was an owl, that's probably what I'd spend money on. Maybe not dead mice, maybe live mice so you can then hunt them, I don't know. Dinner and a show, or something. In 
Linda. Yeah, there's um I can't remember if you get anything from finishing the picture panel. I can't remember if it's like you have to beat everything, like 100% everything to get something, but let's find out. Okay, well, looks like it would be like, oh, hey, get all the treasure too. Uh, no. <laughs> no, I don't feel like doing that. So that's going to be the last time we're playing that, at least for now. Maybe another time, but probably not. Um... I'm going to end this stream, and very shortly, probably like 1.45, we'll start up on RimWorld and play that for a few hours and have a good time there. But yeah, thank you. Wee ween! Yes! <laughs> so yeah, I'm going to end this particular stream. Yeah, thanks for being here, Neki. Uh, yeah, I'm going to end this one. Uh, let me see, I can drop a raid on someone real quick, but... I can drop a, I can drop a raid real quick if I can find someone that's live. Let me close that now. Just cause, just for the sake of I don't know doing it. Uh, let's see who are you? Okay, Jedi. Hmm. Hmm. On second thought, yeah, I think I'm just going to end, and then uh, very shortly, probably like 1.45, I'll be ready to go with some RimWorld, so I'll see you next time I see you. If that's, if that's next stream, then awesome, and if that's just another time, then that's fine, too. I'll see y'all later. I'll be back soon, but for now, have a nice day.